Hello everyone, good afternoon. It's Katie Joy from Without a Crystal Ball. Make sure before we get started, you give me a thumbs up on this video um, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. We're gonna jump into a story about Ryan Edwards. We have not talked about Ryan in a minute and I figured let's get started. All right, so we all know that Mr. Edwards has been out of the clinker since April. His wife, Mackenzie, is knocked up or preggers with their second baby. Um, the pregnancy was a surprise following his release from county jail um, for a violation of a previous charge related to his use of heroin. All right, so here we go. You know that he has had multiple uh, arrests over the years related to issues with alcohol and um, drug abuse. And since then, he has been in photos and he hasn't really been on social media a whole lot. He doesn't really have his own social media. And so the only time fans really get any pictures of him is when his um, third stage Klingon wife, Mackenzie Edwards, <laughs> or his black widow or whatever you want to call her shares photos of him online now yesterday or over the weekend they were at the beach and she shared some photos with her and the kids and Ryan and it had some people kind of concerned now I'll show you the photos and then I'll show you some other photos of him and we can sort of do some cross comparisons and then I'll tell you what parent um, the response that people were having related to these photos I can't say what I think about this, to be honest, but I figured since we haven't talked about Ryan and these are some photos, it might be a good place to start. Now, okay. So, here is the photo in question. It has many people wondering, and as you can see, Mackenzie has done her best to really darken and shade out her tan. Um, she colored so poorly that um, they all look like they're practically um, black, but that doesn't really matter. Her, her editing skills aren't really the question here. It's the eyes of Mr. Edwards. Now I'll blow this up for you so you can see this, but many people are worried because his eyes look very reminiscent of other photos that we've seen of him when he has been under the influence. So um, I'll show you a couple other photos to give you sort of a cross comparison. So this was over the weekend. Now, um, this was um, a mugshot of his. You can see again the eyes. I don't know how they're they're bigger, right? Um, there's another one. I think like the eyes there. You can tell have very small pupils and they're sort of bloodshot. Um, another one where his eyes are very big. The pupils are very small. Um, and this one you can't really see his eyes. And that's the problem is you can't really see the pupils at all in these photos. So it was really hard to tell whether or not. He has the pinpoint pupils. Um, pinpoint, pupil, pinpoint pupils, and why I bring that up, is a common um, symptom or reaction when you are on opioids. Now, some people on Instagram immediately were like accusing him as being like high AF, right? Like he looks like he's under the influence according to people. And so a lot of comments start dribbling in on Instagram, which prompted some reactions by Mackenzie because Mackenzie's never one to actually like um, not respond. So I'll show you that. So um, people were stating on Instagram that he, you know, appears high. She tells them, she, Mackenzie responds and says, you look like a bee. Um, others said he looks high as a kite. Um, You know, people were just sort of going on about how unwell he looks. Um, you can't you can't ignore those eyes. Other people were saying that he looked really good. His eyes still look bugged out, and that was always one of the things with Ryan is his eyes always did look bugged out. He very very rarely um, blinked his eyes. Now, one person said that he's probably on methadone or Suboxone, which could cause his eyes to look like that. He he's put on weight. I doubt he's using it again. Plus, he's she knows he's going to be attacked if he's if he is, so she thinks she'd not post these. So yes, um, that's true that the medications used to treat this specific um, 
issue um, can also do this to his eyes. I don't necessarily know that he actually looks bad. Um, he's looked a whole lot worse um, in photos. It's really hard to say based on a photo when you really can't um, see exactly what his eyes are doing. I don't know if the, you know, that's a good question, allergy free. I don't know if they could be do, have done any sort of long-term issues, but I don't know you guys, when I see this photo of him, he, I don't know, he doesn't, I mean, yeah, he's gained a little bit of weight, but he doesn't look as heavy as he did before. Um, you know, when he, <clears throat> now I think some of the issues still are that he is not necessarily completely clean. I know that he still drinks beer and alcohol because, you know, he says that he never had issues with those. But for um, someone in, in the, where he's at, that's a very, very, very slippery, slippery, uh, very, very, very slippery slope. Um, it's really hard for me to say whether or not, you know, um, he is. Um, there was some other, she shared some other photos. Did I share the other photo? There was another photo of him with the baby. I don't know that I grabbed that one. Let me see if I can get that for you guys. Um, where he has sunglasses on and he does wear sunglasses a lot. I mean, it wouldn't be abnormal if you're at the beach to be wearing sunglasses, to be quite honest. Um, so here's him holding Jagger. I don't necessarily see, again, a massive amount of weight gain here. I mean, yes, he's a little bit fuller than he has been, but um, I don't know. You know, with Ryan, it's not, it's never easy to tell. Um, I don't really, I don't know, you guys. I would agree with some of the commenters that, you know, it's, you know, Mackenzie is going to say no regardless because she always says no, you know, and when anyone ever has a brought issues to her or a concerns, like for instance, when um, Macy brought up issues related to um, what was going on before everything was kind of revealed about what he was dealing with. Um, she remember she wrote a, like she wrote a hate letter to him, to her and accused Macy of, you know, exploiting him and not supporting him and being really a bad influence and all these things. So Mackenzie is his absolute number one enabler next to his mother, Jen. Um, but it's hard to tell whether or not he is. Um, so I can't say. Now, if you are a professional that knows about this stuff, let me know what your thoughts are. Um, I don't really know. Um, and it's, it's tough because you don't want to like, as much as you like, he can be kind of a villain on this show. I will always be rooting for someone to overcome something like this because it is such a, uh, serious issue that can, you know, it's causing people to pass away all over the country and I will root for anyone to get clean and I will hope that and with that for anyone that they um you know they can recover I don't know that he does no I think no his primary uh I don't believe he does uppers so um it's definitely difficult with the sun it's definitely difficult with the angle it's just you guys, it's really hard to say based on that. I mean, yes, his eyes are open very large, but he has very large eyes to begin with. So I, I don't really know. I think at this point, fans will say just about anything out of concern. Um, what I will say is it's really nice to see him spending some time with Bentley. He doesn't get to do that very frequently. So I'm sure that, you know, it was nice for Bentley to spend time with his dad. And I would hope that while he was with his father, that his father was in his best frame of mind, um, no matter where he was at. Um, and I would also venture to guess that if he has been going through some sort of like uh, program, he would might be on specific medications that could potentially do those things to his eyes as well. Um, yeah, I would kind of agree with you, Courtney. I don't know. I think he actually looks really healthy. <laughs> we haven't seen him looking very healthy in a really long time, and I don't really know that I see anything negative here in these pictures. Um, yeah, he did hide behind glasses or, or you know, and you know, guys, he's got another baby on the way and he's got a little baby now. So I think like 
hopeful, being hopeful isn't a bad thing. Um, wanting him to get his stuff together isn't a bad thing. And being, you know, being like skeptical also isn't a bad thing, but I don't know. I don't really see much here, but I just wanted to share them with you to see what your thoughts were. So, uh, tell me what you think after looking at them. And do you really think it's like, okay for people to be speculating about this kind of stuff? Um, I'm going to just remain hopeful and just hope that he is just on the up and up. All right, you guys, I'll be back later with more truth instead of tea.